a new hand to hold. He stood and he stared and he reached for the hand of the person he hoped would help him understand. But the hand was not there and the bad feelings grew and before long he found he knew not what to do. The feelings grew bigger and harder to tame. They were ugly and scary. He knew not their name. He tried to contain them, but when they burst out, it changed him completely. He'd scream and he'd shout, but everyone thought he was naughty and bad. Nobody knew that he'd just lost his dad. The hand that was missing unravelled his mind and made it too hard to be calm and be kind. Things got no better for quite a long time, until one day a teacher said, Why not hold mine? Your dad's hand is missing, that must make you sad. But if you hold my hand, we'll make things less bad. So he reached out his fingers with caution at first, as he realised that things could not get any worse. And as he held on to this new hand, he found that slowly he put his feet back on the ground. Things were not easy, he had to work hard, but he felt things improve as he let down his guard. And alongside his teacher, he felt safe and secure. It felt better than feeling so sad and unsure.